Mason Morelli is back in Minot, and the former magician and Minotauro skater has a new look. Not only has he shaved that playoff beard that he grew for the Hershey Bears Calder Championship run, but now he's a member of the Las Vegas Golden Knights organization. The 27-year-old signed a two-year, two-way contract with the Golden Knights last week. That two-way means he can move between the Golden Knights roster and the team's AHL affiliate, the Henderson Silver Knights. Now he's back home for a bit. He's watching the Minotauros main camp and sharing some advice with those whose shoes or skates he was in a few years back. I think if you work hard, you're a good person. You have a good attitude, and you're you know a good teammate. I think I think the world is your oyster, and what uh, you know what goes around comes around. And I think if you're just a good person, you work hard. And, and put your time in, I think good things will happen. And I tell Mac that all the time, and I'm really proud of him. He's, he's been doing really good things, and he works hard. And um, yeah, it's been it's just been fun to come back and get a lot of you know support from from everyone in mine out here. Mason's talking about his younger brother Mackley or Mac, an incoming junior at Minot High, trying out for the Toros this week. He's playing a solid two-way game, and that's why I told him. I said, if you know, that's what it's going to take to get you to the next level. Play good defense and. You know, chip in offensively when you can. And the biggest thing is getting this experience, right? Playing against guys that are a little older than him and a little faster. And I told him it's only going to be a, it's only going to be good for you. you learn, learn some stuff. Mason told me he'll train in Omaha this summer, where he went to school. And Golden Knights training camp starts in December. When that guy talks, I would listen. <laughs> While we're giving out free advice, I spoke with Eric Foster. He just graduated from Rugby High School for today's graduate guidance. Number nine, Eric Foster. Enjoy all the memories because uh, four years seems like a long time, but it goes by really fast. Whether it's football, <laughs> basketball, or any of Eric Foster's four sports, it's important to always follow through. After my freshman year, I actually thought about not doing football, but my friends and family convinced me, and I'm so happy to say I did because I love football. Follow through tackles and promises. I'm really happy I kept with it. Eric won the District 11 Senior Athlete of the Year Award this basketball season. Even though the Panthers' six-year district championship win streak came to an end. This one moment doesn't define you and just keep your head up and keep going. But you can't let it affect you. Just again, like move on to the next thing. Do, do the best you can. Eric earned his leadership positions. Always listen to the upperclassmen and the coaches because they're looking out for you. Eric will attend Concordia College in Moorhead where he'll play Division III basketball and study finance in the fall between him and Mason Morelli. I think we all just got a little smarter today. I know, and he's got a great uh, support base behind him too. I agree. We'll be right back.